Hall of Fame trainer Bob Baffert is now trying to fight to clear his name. WDRB Stefan Johnson shows us the upcoming decision that could decide his fate. Bob Baffert is known for what his horses have done here on the track at Churchill Downs, but this week he's in the hot seat in front of the New York Racing Association fighting for his reputation and license. Okay, here he is. Just days after the 2021 Kentucky Derby, Bob Baffert's horse, Medina Spirit, tested positive for a banned substance. Yesterday, I got the biggest gut punch in racing for something that I didn't do. Since then, Baffert has been fighting what may seem like an uphill battle to clear his name. First, Churchill Downs suspended him. Then the New York Racing Association followed, but a federal judge reversed that decision. It is now in the hands of a hearing officer. And in December, the horse at the center of the controversy died of an apparent heart attack after a workout. I don't think the death of the horse had anything to do with Baffert. On Thursday, Baffert testified at a hearing with the New York Racing Association, hoping to prevent his suspension there. But in closing arguments on Friday, an attorney accused the trainer of threatening the integrity of horse racing. I hope they get it right. Um, I have a lot of respect for Baffert. As Baffert fights for his license and reputation in New York, race fans at Churchill Downs are keeping one eye on the simulcast and the other on the hearing. I bet a lot of horses from Baffert, and he's tough. I mean, he, he gets good stock, and um, a knowledgeable trainer that gets good horses is going to win a lot of races. A hearing officer will now put together a report, and then both sides will have a week to respond. The final say will be in the hands of a panel. At Churchill Downs, I'm Stefan Johnson, WDRB News.